straight to the next level, because now would be a good time to go check out Dasan's tale. This is the DLC chapter, full of the DLC, and it's going to actually tell about how Dasan's story went back in the day. So here we go. It was Wait, the DLC's like inserted in the game mid You can play it at literally any time you want. But okay. it's a standalone story, so to speak, but this is the best time for it, I think. Okay. We had struck a deal with some bandits. We would watch over there. <sighs> so that is not the most guards I've seen you kill in a time, mission yet. But a lot of guard guards. Mm -hmm. But in time, they learned of the true value of the plants. And like vermin. Is this the only us. DLC for the game? The this is the only DLC that I'm aware of. To straighten them out. So the basic idea is that those bandits at the Tabriz warehouse are supposed to be like they made a deal with the ninja clan to hey you guard our uh smuggling that we're handling that we're handling and in turn we'll protect this warehouse that has your weird flowers if you want and now that the bandits have realized hey these flowers have ridiculously cool powers they're trying to hold them hostage so they're sending mm -hmm. in dosan to say hey get them to cut that out now dosan does not have the mark so he does not freeze time when he does focus, and he can't stop, he can't look around with farsight. But he has a couple other things. I never carried like CQC. It was pride, really. Back then I could what? bring down I anyone him. with my bad. They're coming for you! He got I have immediately failed in using this reliably. But yeah, the basic idea is that the path of wisdom that we have can knock dudes out pretty much effortlessly. Oh. Any quick time events needed? Uh, nope. It's just you walk up behind a dude, you tackle him, then they're unconscious. However, because they're unconscious and not dead, this means a couple of things. First, the other guards can revive them if they happen to get close. And second, that if you actually want to kill them, you'll have to find a more creative way to do it. What was that noise? Alright, so I'm gonna Wait, how long do the uh, guards stay take down? Yes. They don't actually revive unless yeah. another guard comes over and revives them. You also uh... don't get any points for taking down guards, so... You mostly just do it to get them out of your way. Okay. Interesting. So yeah, we could, like, take this guard that we just knocked out and throw him on the spikes, that would kill him, but I'm not gonna go out of my way to do anything like that. Just seems kind of cruel, you know? Cruelty is the... Cruelty is the mark of a ninja. Sorry, am I... I'm producing, like, noise or something? There's, like, a little blipping noise. Okay, uh, let me see if I can do something about that. Uh, okay. But that being said, uh... Here's the now, first do you Sorry, have a box? That's usually not an issue, so let me see if I can... You don't have a box, but you do have the two DLC items. Suspicion. Ooh, and one of the DLC features items. of the Path of Wisdom, which is what Dasan plays as, is that you get double the maximum items for whatever you take. So the Dusk Mods, you throw them at lights, those lights are dark for a while. Like, you don't even break them, it's just that light is off. The DLC items are overpowered as hell. You can also throw them at any guard to stun them. That does sound pretty powerful, actually, given the context of the other items in this game. Mm -hmm. So, um, with the lights being off temporarily, that means does the guards freak out about them? No, they, like they don't even notice because it's completely noiseless. Huh. They don't care about the fact that the light went dim. Nope, not even a little bit. Yeah. That does sound very powerful. You, you think that's powerful? You should wait until we get to the next one. It's gonna make that seem like nothing. I'm almost concerned. It's also so gonna... is it me or did... Did your non-lethal takedowns not require any quick time event? They do not. Or did they? Okay. So it's kind of like that, um... 
murder path, but with less uh, murder. Murder. All the murder of the murder path, but without the murder of the murder path. Exactly. Trace, taste great, less filling. What's this lever do? Believe it or not, that was non lethal. I keep trying to go for Farsight, but I keep not having access to it. It's a little annoying. So wait, are all your takedowns non-lethal, even like environmental core ones? Oh no, it, like that trap is legitimately non-lethal. I know it should look like it is, because I kind of thwomped the guy, but no, that was actually a non-lethal trap. That doesn't make sense. It I doesn't! Know. What is he going to do if a guard finds him? Like The guard is going is to freak going out, because oh no, that trap got one of our guys! Oh, oh, oh. Uh, okay. I, I, it seems that ninjas move a lot of crates around in this game. Hmm, I guess so. Like, like they push a lot of they they pull a lot of levers and lift a lot of like giant blocks around. Rather, I, I feel like this is the uncharted style of ninja. <laughs> they have to do lots of random puzzles as well. Well, we are in the, uh, like, weird bandit layer things. I don't know if that's a factor. Stand still too long, and you would feel the scorpion. Then just do have no honor. honor. Well, that's a very weird thing to say. You know, among thieves. We have. That's how we gain our upgrades, is by accruing honor. Excuse uh, yeah, me. The ninjas are uh, murderers, not thieves. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, well, yeah, but the ninja is sneaking through bandits, so they, therefore they are among thieves. But I guess there is honors among them because the. This is so confusing. Nope. That was wrong. I can't believe you had to make this so complicated. Well, you saw the board games I talked about. No. Now, tripwires are always that, like, thick chain item. Right. Right. Yeah. So, there was a tri tripwire on the upper path as well, what I say? Yes. And you just got darted, from what I also saw? Yep. Mm. Those darts are lethal, because they are tipped it with is. poison, I suspect. They, they might just be tipped with puncture. I mean, we can take multiple bullet wounds without dying, so who's to say, really? They're very big darts, though. Bullets are tiny. I don't know. It, it is a mystery, like the ways of the maybe, ninja. Maybe they're armor-piercing darts. Alright, here's our Those attack item darts. that we get as the DLC. Fungal spores create the suffocating power. All enemies become infected, and anyone who approaches will cause the spores to rupture again. We discovered the fungus the first time we came to debris. Say that one more time. In the right Fungal hand, spores. Deadly and contagious. Yeah, a traditional ninja weapon, you know. The plants grew yep. in an Everybody loves mushrooms. What would so a video this, game be with a mushroom? So this is a Naughty Dog game, then. <laughs> oh, I thought it was a Mario game. Well... There's it slightly less poison than Mario. By slightly. Or other. Every hallway was filled All right, so this is another very Mega Man Those sort of area. Didn't know about half of them. What we're supposed to do is but we're supposed I to did. basically I terrify the hell out of all the bandits. There's three, levels, three layers of traps that we traps. can activate throughout here. The first would reactivate a bunch of old gunpowder bombs. He's going to go over all the different traps right now. We're free to tackle these in any order, but the more of them we activate, obviously the, the harder it will be to get all around the all the different areas. Spaces with spikes. My Fire question the is, are there going to be Yoku the blocks? Of the fortress would cause the old I do Lion not know. To collapse. I do know. There's the, I'm sorry. Arm two of the fortress traps that being seen. Anyway, back to the fungal spores. These are ridiculous. They sound rather ridiculous. I'm kind of scared of them. Like here, we'll chuck them there. 
and totally miss. Now I want to throw them right at the guard. This will instantly kill them, and then their body will be infected and start making a hissing noise. That hissing noise is pretty persistent too. Like it's gonna go hiss. Huh? He got someone. What was that? There's a dead guy. Let me go investigate. The spores instantly kill them too. What it's, was this about non-lethal? I changed my mind. But less uh, flippantly. Like, everything about this skill set leads you to think, oh, you just play this non-lethally. But no, you can totally play this as a lethal thing, even without the sword. It's just, oh, after you knock out a guy, do something horrible to them. Yeah, just violate a few Geneva Conventions, he's going to care. Also, yeah, like, you compare these to the spike mines, it's not even close. The fungal spores are way stronger. No, it's like the spike mines, except it just keeps killing. Exactly. It just keeps spiking. There is another item you can get that you throw right at the guard and it does just kill them. But it the also does it very slowly you. and loudly, so it's not perfect. Although I think that with that- That situation be useful. Yeah. It's also meant to be used to actually clear away bodies. Spoilers, it's the beetles. You get, you get beetles, and you throw them at people, and they're like, Oh no! Like, beetles! A traditional ninja weapon! I can't believe you threw George Harrison at a man. I know, right? <laughs> what a horrible way to go. I, I, I was... Yeah, his his feeding powers know no limits. I, I was... So, basically, it's the mummy now. Yo, the, I'm alive. Hey, Hi. Beat! Hey! hey. So we're, we're seeing the ending of the tale of Mark Ninja. Oh... Mar Marky Ninja? Yeah, Marky Ninja. Marky Ninja Bunch. Marky Ninja and the Funky Bunch. Aw, oh, man. I love Marky Ninja. It's so sad. I'm so sorry. The, uh... The DLC is happening right now, it looks like. Yep. And, uh... Oh, okay. And apparently... There's this DLC for this game? There was. Yeah. Uh, there is. I'm playing it right now. Right. There's, yeah. uh, fungal spores that can just... That are like spike mines, except they continue spiking because they kill a person, people walk up, and it kills them again. Ah. This is the poison that keeps on giving. Yep. Ah, uh, it keeps on giving. And yeah, there I just used the dusk mods on that lamp. It's out. The guard here does not notice or care. They never knew yeah, he's not, um, uh, not the brightest. Like, they notice if you break it because it's like, hey, this light bulb broke. That was really loud. What the hell is the deal with that? But if you, like, just turn it off by surrounding it with moths, as one does... Hey! He's here! The guard goes, man, that's a lot of moths. How very curious. I well, love I moths. guess I'm gonna go on my patrol. Yep. Business as usual. Right, I've gotta be close to the lever by now. It's through here, right? Yeah! 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 So... Lever. The, uh... The guards in their non-lethal takedown, they they don't wake up by themselves due to a timer or anything, do they? They do not. They will stay okay. knocked out. I apparently got an indirect kill at some point. Oh, that's why, because I turned on all the spikes in the tunnels and I hid a body in there. Ah. Yeah, he's dead. Yeah, he... I always hate when I do that. Is that a seal breaker? No, no. We're we're allowed to do that. Okay, well that's fine. All right. Eh, yeah, these guys are gonna die. I decided this. We have you now. Normal. Normal, reasonable, and I think if I go into any of the smaller vent spaces now, I will just flat out get killed because of spikes. Because of spikes. Spikes are a good way to die. An honest death. Honorable death. If you say so. I do. I so did. if they if they were an honorable death. You got an indirect death. kill. What the heck just happened? Uh, the spikes in the tunnels that came from that trap I activated, most likely. Oh wow! I must have a lot of uh, must have a lot of lag going on here. Yeah, oh. I I can't actually see it right now, unfortunately. I just died to well, those self same traps. Well, there was a second indirect kill after you opened that door. I'm curious what happened there. I think it's just I dumped another body in there, and they also got spiked. I think that's uh, just a thing that's gonna happen from here on out. Okay. All right. 
So the entire like secret air duct section is just covered in spikes. That now. fortress had stopped yep. the worst armies the world could. It is it. a Mega Man level to the T, essentially. Yes. Or... Okay then. He got someone. Ooh, yeah. Wow, that's uh, that is a lot of spikes in an air duct. Sometimes you know where ninjas come from, and you put. Cover the place of traps. I I guess spiking an air duct makes some degree of sense if ninjas are 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 a pest in your environment. The natural uh, predator of ninjas is spike traps. After all. someone is down. If there's one thing that his Shinobi series has taught us, it's that. We are coming for you. I heard something. Dope. He got someone! Uh, hey! I hear something. Yeah. Hey, I got an achievement. Good for me. Wow, uh, I, well, I came back in an exciting moment. Aw, oh, you died. I died. An exciting moment for achieving things. Yeah, for a moment you were achieving, but then you died. Like a dork. Yeah, but you did like a dork. Achieving. I, I achieved all over again. Oh man, look at this achievement, boy. All these numbers. Ranking of deaths from best to worst. Killed by spikes in a air vent? Best. No, Killed best by is a space. Guard. Worst. Dying Dude, in space. Best. Ultra yeah. best. I mean, must be real. Failing to open a jar of pickles and accidentally choking to death on your own tongue because you were straining too hard for the pickle jar. <laughs> Maximum worst. I don't know. I, that no, I'm actually so. really impressed with that one. I don't even know. Yeah. How <laughs> That's kind of like one of those ones that loops around to being the best again. Mm -hmm. Like it was really bad, but it kind of was kind of amazing because of it. Oh wait, I see what like I got. It's do. so impossibly bad that it shouldn't have been possible at all. The, yeah. the the room of, of of bad deaths. I really don't yeah. want anything in my death to be compared to the room. All right, there we go. CQC for Those days. Spikes are tearing me apart, Lisa. Well, the Becky fan now too. <laughs> Somehow yep. I didn't get seen Sorry, here at Techie. all. Sorry, Not friends anymore. What's happened? I actually can ban people from my channel. I can oh, make shit. him go away. Uh -oh. oh no! I can just take oh, him no. away. Send him to okay. the shadow realm. I can't believe he's being- he's getting hit by Spike Shadow Realm Buzzsaws. Says the yeah, person not just regular buzz shoving saws spikes that cut flesh. That would just be weird. <laughs> yeah. I would like my items Nobody back now, that'd be those. great. Also, seriously, how Items are for nerds. Oh, am I supposed to be going out through there instead of risking life and limb going into the spike hallways every time? I'm a good ninja. Let me think about this, yes. Hmm? Maybe. Well, yes. yeah, see, this is the sensible I don't think you had time to think in that statement. You just sort of ran through that. Yeah. Yes, I did. Yes. A lot of thoughts going all across this ninja. All thoughts. Too many thoughts. Alright. Surely I don't have to go through this spiked hallway thing to get where I need to go, but I'm gonna do it anyway. You do. You do. Anyway, yeah, that's the thing we did. It means... matter of spike hallway, you don't need to go through. It's a matter of pride. All spike hallways are important. They're are part the spikes? Of, they're part of our ninja heritage. So the spikes hallways, they're are they the ones that just like pop spikes up as you walk on them, or are they the ones that are just spikes already? Uh, uh, when we hit the it... first lever, we activated them, which turned the normal vents that we could just crawl through as much as we please into vents that have lots of spikes that will activate on a short timer after we trip them. Which is hey, the uh, okay. Does my voice sound better now? Yeah, Sounds about the same. Alright, cool. I am. Uh, I cancelled the YouTube upload because it was choking my internet to death. Uh, well, I can't believe YouTube's dead. What were you uploading? I was uh, uploading... I never why, you, why is Nuki muted? <laughs> I don't know, that's his business. Um, I was uploading um, some stuff for Let's Plays uh, that I've been meaning to do and haven't been doing because I'm, I'm lazy. excited. You shouldn't be. It's extremely Too bad. late, I am. Extremely bad. 
almost like just said, ah, screw it, I'm just gonna redo it because I don't like it, but nope, nope, I guess I'm running uh, from now. That's a promise. It's, extreme, it's extremely canon now that I, know, man, man, I know, right? That's the way all my LP canon yeah, works. Not for me. That is Where's a uh, very swingy blade. Oh yeah, they just have like flying guillotine swords for no good reason. That's, um, uh, that's actually a clock. Very fancy clock. Tick tock, tick tock. Yep. Just uh, last trap was a Capri's death it pendulum. Was time to infiltrate the conservatory. Yeah. Wait, no. Get out. I get out. I, I honestly didn't get think, out. Didn't think that through. Get out. Dart. I got darted. I got Shen mood. Oh no. Did Shen mood get darted? I think so. I don't know. I, I didn't beat Shen mood too. Or Shen mood one. Uh, I thought he just got like. He played darts. Uh, he did play darts. Yeah. So, I guess he did get Shenmue by Shenmue rather than. Yeah, yep. that's how he got Shenmue. Okay, Mr. What did Shenmue. What you think he met by Shenmue? I thought that Shenmue got attacked by darts at some point. It it's became the addiction that took over his life. If that's what you're talking about. Oh. Okay. And that's exactly what happened here. I thought that was forklifting. Eh, I mean, you you can go anywhere you want. It's the original open world game, right? Oh, also you get double so. restores of your items at checkpoints? That's nuts! Why is everything from the DLC so overpowered? Because tattoo artists are dangerous creatures. Tattoo artists are extremely dangerous. Clearly he wow. has to die. Yes. Especially if they're ninjas, then that's just like... Hmm. It's just a oh yeah, that's trouble. like that's like putting ten um, uh, ten pounds of dangerous in a five pound box. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm so tired. Okay, nothing I'm saying makes sense anymore. That, you know, know that's totally fine. That's, 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 <laughs> that one makes sense. Ninja, double your fun. My my also, brain is not how long working, this was. so maybe that's the reason why I think ah, you're back. An absolutely great. Say sorry. Uh, there is there is a bunch of stuff happening right now, so I may end up muting my mic a couple more times. No worries. The stream ends. We forgive you. I didn't even show up until, like, way late. Hmm. We basically showed up for hmm. the finale to remind yeah. he's still alive. Screw you. Did you break that guy's neck? Maybe. Okay. Press F to break Yes. Neck. How did I not get killed by that? We will find you. Skills. Skills. Yeah, sure, we'll go with that. Outstanding death. No, 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 no. He had the outstanding deaths, but then he uh, covered them with his skittles. Wow, he got an indirect kill by him uh, body slamming him into a grenade. I think that counts as a direct kill. Yeah, I mean, but also counts that's as That's like saying separate. I didn't mean to kill that man, I suplexed straight into the sewer. <laughs> yeah, th this just got a whole lot more Killer7 right here. It's only Killer7 when, the when like, a secretary invites you to play a game of Russian roulette. Chief Apparently, no, the trailer they did for the um, uh, new PC I remake of the HD remake of Killer Seven actually just mess. used um, uh, emulator footage. Kind I, of I'm going to be really depressed a little bit of that. But I'm yeah. going to be really depressed when the PC port of Killer no Seven doubt. turns out to be caught being done by Miss America. Yeah, I know, right? Oh, oh God! God. <laughs> I mean, I love Killer Seven, and I will be very sad if it turns out to be trash because they they outsource it to the worst people imaginable. Oh, did they? Uh, <laughs> it's Miss America who, if you weren't following the East Eight saga, are not great at porting things to PC. Oh, okay. Oh dear God! Yeah, that's uh... most likely that's... they were the ones who were willing to do it for the cheapest. Yeah, I mean, uh, which is kind of a shame, right? Because the um uh, the, the port of Flower, Sun, and Rain, really good. <laughs> the one on PS, uh, the one on DS. Yeah, that was done no, by hand. No, 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 no the, the, not that one. Uh, Silver Case, that was one. Oh, one. Silver Case, that was done by uh, like play or whatever. Yeah. Oh. Okay, so there's Strange. actually two ways we can complete the objective that we're looking at here. All uh -huh. the bandits in the conservatory, we can kill or knock out all of them, which is what most people do. Or you can just terrify five of them. I think... Well, you already got to terrify one of them. I think you should just run through really fast, like... Yeah, isn't terrifying just murdering of a soul? Yeah. He got... And... 
And it seems like your seal objective already wants you to terrify a bandit or two, so... I mean, yeah, I mean, we've already done that. It's pretty easy. Did you just kill that guy with, like, a, a smasher? It's non-lethal. I swear it's non-lethal. Uh, he's stuck to the ceiling. Non-lethally. Like giant spikes. He is non like when Batman. stuck to the ceiling. Yeah, it's... This is Batman like when Batman hits someone with his frickin' Batmobile in Arkham Knight and just play both of them. It's... Knocked out. They're just sleeping. <laughs> yeah. Jeez. I'm still a good boy. All right. Where's the next? Oh, I see where it is. So if I do that, and someone notices that and is like, "Oh, that guy's on the ceiling. What the hell is he doing on the ceiling?" <laughs> exactly like that. Can you knock out a terrified person and then just have a chain of terror? Like, another guy walks up, gets terrified, knock out that person, terrify the next guy. Typically, you gotta kill somebody to terrify somebody. Well, there That's was that, that works. Whole, there was that non-lethal thwomp that apparently terrified somebody. Yeah, so. I mean, it's very good at doing terrifying. that. What we can do. So what is exactly the non-lethal thwomp? From the shadows, I would see don't like know. It's is very it like, non-lethal, though. We, have, we seriously have to establish that. It's a little hard to tell. It looks like, like a smasher like with barbed wire. Like yeah, it not really looks like a smasher wire. with barbed wire. Yeah. Uh, well, I, I mean, think, I'm just going to assume it's Velcro, and they're all wearing like the oh, other no. side of the Velcro shirts, and that's why they stick to it. Yes, this makes perfect sense to me. Also, it's not made out of metal; it's made out of pillows. I mean, Velcro is kind of terrifying. It reminds yes, exactly. me of the '90s. I can hear them shouting right now. Oh no! I'm stuck to the ceiling. How scary! And the other guys who see it go, "Oh goodness! I am also scared by the scary turn of the events." That seems very logical to me. Very logical. I just, I just thought these guys were scared of Velcro. That too. It's very terrifying texture. <laughs> Oh no, I'm frightened! Wow, don't be rude for one minute. I feel like you're being a rude boy. boy. I think he's. I think I'm being a good boy, and the ninjas are the ones being the bad boys. In a surprise turn of events. I heard that! There's no one here. Nobody here at all. Nobody here. Huh. You are hallucinating you in your mind. Oh, still... secrets. He's still alive, huh? I have no idea how far behind Maybe that is. Everyone's still alive. I haven't killed anyone in the observatory uh, yet. Oh, okay. I see. Probably I like just I figured minutes. that dropping like a heavy weight on some dude would crush him. Yeah, you'd think, but you'd be wrong. I guess heavy not. Heavy weights are actually uh, the best, nicest, and coolest thing you can do for somebody. Well, it's not dropped. It's just drops like an inch above like crushing them. And oh, okay. You know, just enough to stick him to it. <laughs> yeah. Get a good stick. Now it's time for the magical anti-grav! Somehow this works. I oh, mean, anti-grav is my favorite way to scare guards. They're all like, oh god, I'm floating! What He's the hell? floating! How did this happen? What the fuck? God damn, oh no! Oh I no, it's... Very, I've very seen a ghost mouse. movie with this. Oh, that's the same guy, isn't it? Probably. Wow, I was trying to get a new guard to terrify, and you have to come over here and be the same old guard that I'm terrifying? I'm halfway... Oh, uh, it has to be a different guard each time. Uh, you you can't just repeatedly terrify the same guard. I mean, you can, but you won't get anything out of it. Good sense of accomplishment. That, that's true. Alright, you know what? Here's, here's the plan. Is Jones over here. That guard's barely thwomped. How is he sticking to that? Like, I know. There? That that is like poltergeist level of thwomp. I made a discovery. I'm just going to use the same thwomp for ages. Is worth more that than I Does like it. it. Fit the number of guards in every spot. Wait, that hey, work? I see it. Yes. I yes, getting getting thwomped is very scary. I pushed my luck too far. I mean, I didn't know where broke, that last so. guard came from, but apparently Final I terrified five almost got away. Oh no, one of them saw you! Oh, oh no! Oh no! Now nah, we're good. We got away from that really easily. Very right, cool. And screw this guy. And I wonder. Okay, we can walk right by Fungal Spore's hand without dying. That's interesting. 
Well, they they know your scent. That's true. I mean, if they would kill you immediately, then like, how are you carrying them? We're like, using the like little parcels. Well, you could say stuff like, "Oh, they're in a vial, pro like protected, so they don't like keep me alive." But no, they just they're just friendly spores to you, and and they're they're your allies, willing to protect you. Sure. All right, we'll go with that. It, alternatively, it could just be your natural musk, and they just don't want to tell you that. All I can think about now is the supposedly realistic uh, game done. made by that one weird I MRA dude, a where um, uh, the stinky, and the worse you smelled, well, you gained a um, uh, you gained a benefit. All the ladies would be um, a more into you the more yeah. musk you had. Because I I can I can you just stop expounding on this so I can scrub it out of my brain? Yeah, yeah, I think I already gagged a little. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's fair. It is incredibly I saved. I studied it. Yeah, that's why you know when stupid idiots make video games. Nobody knows more of we can't stop them, but we can not pay any attention. We can And I will feel appropriate for Ninja Wars. To oh, yeah. ensure our future. So this is how uh, Ninja became tattoo artist, I suppose. This is how Dasan became a tattoo artist. Which... Also, this mission is super long. I don't know if you noticed. Yes, it is. I did notice. Well, oh, Shooter, are you the Rat King? Awesome. We have defeated the rats, and now we are the we rat king. We must prevent the assassination of the Rat King! Oh! Anyway, that's Wait, the song's this... tale. 